it is time to catch a buzz with your cuz. Today we're going on vacation. Friday, we made it. Hopefully you're feeling good. I'm feeling pretty good. It's a special toast. I thought to myself, I'm feeling like we should have been on vacation. Uh, like many of you, this is a really popular time to go away, have a good time with the family, the friends, whatever, and uh, we're still kind of not there. So I feel cheated a little bit. And I thought to myself, where would I go? Would it be a Caribbean island? Could it be South Padre Island? Would it be Staten Island? Any of the three would have been great. But the one thing that kind of brought it all together is vacation time means my Thai time. And uh, it's one of my favorites. Ironically enough, everybody I spoke to about Mai Tai came back and said the same thing. It's too sweet, uh, you know, too sweet and too sweet. So I thought to myself, how can I make this a little bit better, right? Let's get the sweetness the heck out of there and let's just get a good tasting drink. So for today, what we're going to need is a mixer. Now, ironically enough, uh, this mixer is one of the ones that has recipes on it, and that's the Mai Tai recipe. We'll talk about that in a second. Um, but our recipe, what we're doing, white rum, ounce and a half. I'm using Captain Morgan Caribbean white rum, high quality product, cheap price. Love Captain Morgan. Love to sail the seven seas with Captain Morgan. My twist here is going to be um, with mango. So I thought to myself, where can I get mango? I came up with this, master of mixers. Um, and then I looked at it and I said, dang, this first two ingredients are water and sugar, then mango. I said, you know, this may keep, this may keep the drink too sweet. So I went out and I got some fresh mango puree. We're going to use a half ounce of this. Uh, this is apparently about a third of a mango in here, uh, which really, uh, you yeah, know, peel back the layer of the onion. This is baby food. It's mango puree. As pure as it gets. Um, we're also going to squeeze some fresh lime juice. Quarter ounce of this. If you don't want to do this too much work, you could always use this lime juice here. Uh, either one works fine, and then optionally we can garnish with a pineapple or a cherry. One ounce of rum, one ounce of cherry mix, like grenadine I guess, a third uh, orange juice, two thirds pineapple juice and ice. This is going to be sweet, our little change up is not. So let's go ahead and get this thing together and try it out. Please like and share this video, it's community. Um, People deserve to see this stuff, and if you hang on to the end, I'll let you know who my favorite Disney villain is. Hello! One and a half ounces of rum. Here we go. Oh, pineapple juice. Two and a half ounces. Look at that nice, fresh pineapple juice. No other way to enjoy it. And two and a half of pineapple juice right in the shaker. Looking good, we'll give it a quick swirl. That did absolutely nothing, it's just cool to look at. Mango puree, half an ounce mango puree. We mixed this up really well before. Here we go, we're a little over. We're gonna be fine. Right in the shaker. Let's get our quarter ounce of lime juice. It's a little hard to just see, there we go. We're right on the money. So this is our shaker. It has a uh, strainer built in, so we're in luck. We are going to shake this, and we're gonna pour it into this double rocks glass already filled with ice. Can you use the ice from this mixer in there? Sure, why not? But I'm about speed and efficiency here at my bar. So at this point, we got this thing shaken up. Quick Jersey, uh, Jersey Shore fist pump. Take it off. Strain it. She's a beaut, Clark. Look at that. We're gonna add a cherry, a little pineapple.
Well, that's pretty good. That's a damn good Mai Thai. Let me tell you, um, this is very easy to make. It's very cheap. This may cost you 12 or 15 bucks on vacation. I like it. This is good. This is real good. Oh. I'm gonna have to mix up another one of these. Again, consume responsibly. Uh, so I did promise you uh, that we'll go over who my uh, favorite Disney villain is at the end of the video. Thanks for hanging on. Once again, please uh, share it, like it, comment on it. And uh, the answer would be my wife. Favorite Disney villain is my wife. People love this shirt. Wear it to Disney all the time. Uh, can't wait to get back there. Hope you enjoyed this. Another great happy hour. And uh, looking forward to it again next week.